On this day of the year 1893, Hermann Göring, Hitler's bitter friend, was born. He shared with him the sweet and bitter moments, their friendship dates back to 1922, which is the date of Göring's joining the Nazi party, and this friendship lasted until 1945, which is the year in which World War II ended and in which Göring rebelled against his leader and friend. Göring held high positions in the Nazi party and the state, the last of which was the command of the German Air Force, but after the Germans failed to repel the attacks of the English planes on the sky of Berlin, Göring advised Hitler to stop the war, but Hitler, like all the tyrants of the earth, did not hear but his voice, which prompted Göring to declare himself the leader of Germany, so Hitler arrested him and stripped him of all his ranks and sentenced him to death, but the war had ended and Hitler ended with it before executing the sentence. Göring was no less dictatorial than Hitler. In 1933, he established the most famous system of repression in the history of humanity as a whole, which is the Gestapo, meaning the secret state police. Göring made the Gestapo above the law, and higher than all the courts of Germany, and over the course of twelve years of his presidency of the Gestapo, Göring arrested more than three million people, and executed more than one hundred thousand. The tyrants always rule with iron and fire, and they need arrests and espionage, for injustice is the best maker of enemies, I do not know why I remembered while writing these words the story of the messenger of Khosro with Omar bin al-Khattab, he came to the city at noon asking about the palace of the caliph, and he was told that the caliph does not own a palace, his house is there. The messenger of Khosro intended Omar's house but did not find him, so he began to ask about him the people in the streets, until he was told that he had been walking for a short time to that side, and when he followed him, he found a strange sight, it happened once on the back of this earth and did not repeat after it. Omar was sleeping peacefully, filling his eyes and heart, his shoes under his head, he had secured his subjects so he felt safe. Then the messenger of Khosro said his famous words, you ruled, so you were just, so you felt safe, so you slept. The path that Hitler and Göring chose to rule, a difficult and rough path, is the path of injustice, everyone in it is accused until he proves his innocence, everyone is a potential enemy, and a possible killer, so they needed the Gestapo. While Omar chose the easy path, he defeated empires that resisted Hitler, and fought armies that were no less fierce and trained by the measure of that time than those fought by Hitler in his time, but Omar had the hearts of the people, not their necks, so he had no enemies. Thank you for your time, like and subscribe for more.